Hey everybody, it's uh, Saturday afternoon, beautiful one week away from the big Saturday 17th auction, starts at 10 a.m. We have uh, three days of online only auctions, almost a thousand lots in those three days leading up to uh, the 17th, that's the 14th, 15th, and the 16th. Getting all kind of questions, why isn't it listed and whatnot? Well, we're really busy, we're the ones that go the extra mile and make sure everything's working, everything's looking beautiful, everything's ready to go into your restaurant. Yes, it's not ideal. We'd love to list it a month in advance, but it just doesn't work that way. All right, we're starting off with these uh, swing doors right here. Um, we've got these uh, nice hat coolers coolers here, uh, glass doors, a bunch of shaping fuel, chafers, a lot of small wares in here. Check out this beautiful uh, Ozark sink. That's a portable sink. Oh, did I unlock this? Yeah. Um, it's brand new. It's never been used. I think it's like over two thousand dollars to to go and buy this of course it has hot water and a pump we've got lots of stainless steel in this auction um, we've got some lots of three thousand of aluminum trays lots of three thousand of these packed trays i looked it up it was fifteen hundred dollar value just incredible um, check out this uh, front case here this is a, a duke manufacturing cabinetry we've really got it crammed in there so i, I know you can't get a good look hopefully our pictures are a little better but it's got a federal drop-in cooler. So the Duke Manufacturing, probably four grand for this. And then this unit is an easily five grand. Uh, federal's top of the line. I plugged in, it came down to temperature in about 20 minutes. Uh, in a summer day, that's really good. Um, we've got uh, stainless steel sinks, small wares, all the stuff you kind of see uh, on the regular with us. We have uh, LXI high temps out of a uh, major coffee shop. Uh, this came out of a little French bakery. It's a beautiful unit, nice little kind of table. Uh, some used uh, stainless steel. We've got some induction cooker down here, a uh, waffle maker, uh, blend tech. Here's another waffle maker. We've got a uh, 36 inch griddle, rinse, uh, 24 inch four burner. We've got a, a 12 inch stratus uh, griddle never used. We've got our small wares here. Check out this neat little concession card. This is a new item. It's a 22 inch griddle with a food warmer, so you can actually drop an insert in here, use it as a bain marie, um, or you can uh, you know, put in three or four sections, up to six sections, uh, really, of uh, ingredients, hot ingredients, or soup, or whatever you like. Um, we've got a used, uh, but barely, uh, 48 inch uh, Frontier salad prep table. Prime Master, this has been completely gone through. It came out of a cafeteria. It has been serviced by Key Food. It is in perfect working order. Same with this unit, it came out of the same place. This unit we've yet to try out, but if, uh, I mean, it should be uh, working. It's almost new. We'll have a nice little video of that up and running. Back here we had some trouble refrigeration. This has a new compressor going in it. This one has a new compressor and a control. Uh, and it's a nice rolling cooler. Hopefully we uh, recover the money on those. Um, oh yeah, this garland range. God, can't forget that. This thing. Four burners, 17 inch burners. This is the, the Master Series, 34 inch. Uh, this thing with the convection oven in it uh, has to be it's about $7,000 new. So that's a real value. And that's another one that's been through our refurb shop. It is 100% ready to go. I should be selling it for warranty for $4,500, but we're not a museum. It's going to go to the highest bidder. Nice US range 24 inch griddle here. Over here, we've got our propane uh, configured countertop gas. This place, they, I mean, they didn't, they barely even cooked on it. It's uh, leasing returns. You're going to see a lot of leasing returns in this auction. More still coming. Um, a Mexican restaurant that just closed in New West uh, by the SkyTrain station. We got, grabbed half of that yesterday. I'll show you uh, some of that stuff. Um, but uh, this stuff, like I said, all configured propane and barely used. We've got structural concepts. We put these two together. We always have lots of these uh, units. We have a deal with. Uh, the a very large coffee company that abandoned the concept, but these are top of the line uh, structural concepts. You put these two together just to show you how it works. Your cabinetry grows in here and it's uh, finished. And then on the back, this one has a little service area. And of course this one is a, it's a dry display. All these have LED lights underneath here. They look gorgeous lit up. I'm gonna try and get a video of that for you. This came from Pizza Hut in Washington. They were installed late 2013. Um, they need a bit of a cleanup. They came here on a on an open deck trailer, but 
uh, they're gorgeous, the stones are immaculate, and uh, they paid, I think, six over 16,000 US, and they have buying power, you don't. So this is a real uh, a chance to, to save a lot of money. Uh, we have a nice bakery table here, we've got a smart combi oven, we've got a pizza table, you're gonna have to look at the pictures, we really covered it up with pizza uh, tan, uh, pans and uh, dough boxes. Uh, all brand new and this came out of the French bakery. This is really nice. They were only open for a year uh, Lovely family uh, Didn't work out for them bad location, uh, but they didn't spare any expense in the equipment So uh, we're gonna sell one up top here, and then we're gonna sell the bottom one with the stand So if you want them both you got to buy them both and uh, if you just need one Well, you have the opportunity very deep bakery ovens very very deep bakery ovens um, we've got a nice 100 quart, uh, quarter inch aluminum stock pot here, and then we've got uh, two more of these propane configured radiants. Uh, we've got a couple of new fryers actually. We, uh, normally we're sold out of propane fryers over the summer, but uh, if you see US Inc. or US Refrigeration, it's our overstock and it comes with warranty in the auction. It doesn't matter if it sells in the auction, it still has a warranty for US Inc. and US Refrigeration. Uh, more leasing returns. These uh, optimal Automatics uh, vertical uh, electric broilers. I'm not sure what the model number is on these. Uh, some under counter coolers. There's a ton of under counter refrigeration in the sale. Uh, this is from a major coffee store as well, uh, chain. And it's a 2014 model. It's one of the very last of the NGCs produced uh, for this chain, anyway. Uh, this is a nice Baker's Pride a countertop conveyor belt. We've got some really high-end stainless here. There's an advanced tab co. That's a $3,000 sink with uh, pre rents adding another $500 in value. And then over here, we've got a 10-foot table with a uh, sink in it. Back here, we got, uh, you're gonna see some, uh, quite a bit of scratch and dent, uh, new true refrigeration and uh, refurb. Uh, this is from the installers that work with this massive company. I'm not supposed to say their name. <laughs> But uh, it's brand new. This one was really dropped. All the rest you're going to see scratches, uh, a little ding here, a little uh, dent there. They refuse it when it comes in. This one was actually dropped. It crushed the fan motor. Uh, the compressor went into it. I've had it running for three days. We replaced the fan. It's working great. It's all aesthetic now. Your issues with it. Um, then we've got uh, refurb one door, refurb two doors here, uh, both coolers. Uh, we're going to clear off all this sh uh, high end. Shelving. This unit didn't come out, but you see this is just gorgeous, heavy, heavy um, uh, shelving and I'm, or, uh, drawers, and I'm hoping someone can do something with it. But underneath here, once we get it cleaned off, it's this is gorgeous. We've got a sink in it. Uh, you've got the trash compartment. You've got uh, drawers. These ones are actually refrigerated. These ones are actually refrigerated uh, right here. And then we've got a pan rack in the end, so it's a beautiful custom table. Um, two, four. It's okay. We got enough battery to get through it. Just hit that close button. We'll keep going. Um, then we got this uh, espresso machine. I did a little video on this. The uh, panel to control it is actually gone, unfortunately. Uh, so this will have to be replaced. We have uh, two espresso machines. Oh shoot! Let's run down here quickly. We got half the option I just missed. And how I did that? All right. Wait right there, I'll just, I'll shout it out from here. We've got this beautiful cold stream two door. We've got a Charleston combo unit. I've had it plugged in for two days, holding 37 on the uh, refrigerator side. Oh my God, actually you have to come in and look at this. This is gorgeous. And then you've got the drawers underneath. These are standard hotel pans. So it's like a commercial residential combo. It's called a space saver, uh, the 48 inch version. 48 inch wide, and then you've got the freezer on this side, also a, a freezer drawer underneath, uh, and it's a standard hotel size pan. 30 uh, Fahrenheit, oh 40, now that I've opened it, uh, and now we're over to freezer, it was holding at 4 Fahrenheit. So gorgeous unit. Uh, out of the French bakery, I got, had a little video preview of that, we've got a freezer, refrigerator, uh, display freezer, in the back, we've got uh, double AccuTemp steamers, refurbished, gorgeous shape. This is a $28,000 unit, working great. They just made some major changes to the kitchen. Uh, unfortunately, this unit is electric and it's uh, 480 volt three phase. So not a lot of application for that, but we've got a nice remote steamer here. 
another turbo shaft. I think that one will be selling before. Actually, all this stuff will be. I also have some videos of this thing working. It's beautiful. This is only a year old. This went in used, but this uh, went in uh, new into the French bakery. Um, pot washer, barely used. The uh, dishwasher, uh, our glass washer, barely used. This thing is just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it's the newer model from, uh, I mean, they've only been making this for two years. Uh, and then we've got the glass tender units. High end, everyone knows it's uh, selling as, this one actually has the cover on the ice cream and the, oh, the speed rails and this one has a hand sink attached to it. We've got a huge Irrational Combi oven back there. Sorry, it's at a bad angle. We've got a nice hot box. We've got a cold stream cooler freezer combo. Also out of the place that came with the Cleveland uh, kettles and steamer. Uh, a little perlite glass. In okay, let's head back over here. Where did we leave off? Uh, Walk-in box back there. Can't remember the dimensions, but the, it is water-cooled. I'll note in the description. Uh, it's a very, very, very nice box. And the refrigeration is in great condition as well, but it is uh, water-cooled. We've got uh, two scratch and dent units, true refrigerator and freezer. The other one, like I said, was uh, dumped and uh, had a real issue with this one. It's got a little dent here, and I mean, this has got a few scuff marks on it. So that's actually what most of this new scratch and dent true is. It got refused. Uh, beautiful refurb, two door true freezer here. We've got tables and sinks. There's a Mongolian grill in the corner. Come check out this thing. This is the Imperial 60 inch gas griddle. It's got the insert holders. Adds another foot, so you're, you're looking at more like 72 inches. Comes with the stand, this one. And uh, that's, uh, yeah, that's, is that thermostatic or manual? Thermostatic, gorgeous unit. That must be worth four, four or five thousand dollars. 48 inch char broiler, four burner. Yeah, again, this uh, US Inc. stuff, that's our overstock. It's been selling slowly, and um, it comes with full warranty in the auction. Got a Hobart upright. This is the most expensive thing in the whole auction. It's absolutely gorgeous. Tried to sell it for $7,500, no buyers um, with the uh, owner's permission. This was ordered and it's an inch too big because this is, a, I think, 49 inches wide. No, 50 inches wide. It was supposed to go in to replace a 48 inch. Look at this package. This refrigeration is worth five grand. This thing is absolutely gorgeous. If someone can use this, I know they're going to get a screaming deal. We can sell it for whatever it goes for. And if you went to get this priced out, you'd be looking at about, I would say, twelve, thirteen thousand dollars $13,000, maybe more. You get it for twelve, thirteen thousand dollars to $13,000 for me, but Russell sells you fifteen. dollars All right, more uh, scratch and dent, brand new units, refrigerator and freezer. Again, I challenge you to find where the dent, the ding is. Uh, amazing opportunity to save a ton of money. That has a deposit on it, another nice open merchandiser but I don't think they're going to come through with the rest of the money, and I told them their deadline is the auction. 72-inch uh, uh, Glacier case, also out of the French bakery. Uh, gorgeous unit. Uh, another uh, low, this is a low-temp dishwasher, I want to say. Actually, no, it's a high-temp. The Lambert commercial, with the racks, of course. These never get in. I showed you the structural concepts before. You always see them in the auction, but we never have the 52-inch because we always sell them all out before the auction. We just happen to have one right now, so we put it in the auction. This is the big seller. This is what pays for all the other ones to throw in the auction. Uh, but it is here, so hopefully uh, hopefully someone gets a good deal on that. We've got a couple more of these uh, beautiful freezers. We sold two in the last big auction, or maybe three actually. After this, we've only got one more, and I'm pretty sure we're only selling that retail because they've been doing really well. Uh, the glass door, window, uh, this small little box, I don't remember the dimensions off the top of my head. More of these packer stuff, more of the structural concepts, a few units. Uh, these units all have lights under the shelves. They're uh, gorgeous, they have uh, the night uh, protection, they've got these little things for facing your product. Um, then they've got this for front cleaning for the dry bakery cases. And of course you can customize, you can mix and match the sizes, we have a lot more of them. But these are the ones that are going to go for whatever they go for. Check this out. Beautiful Hobart 20 quart mixer with the hip, uh, whip only. Um, we've got this uh, Doyon, that's a legacy mixer. We've got this Doyon FPR3 uh, three level, three tier uh, pizza convection maker. It's got three timers on it. Uh, we had to replace one of the timers and the capacitor on the motor. Cost us about 800 bucks. Thing is worth about 8,000. So uh, hopefully we uh, recoup the money on that. Um, we've got a six burner USA, 
a 48 inch uh, griddle US Inc. Again, US Inc. US refrigeration, full warranty. This unit, I should offer full warranty, I should retail this uh, because this is, uh, this is worth about 12,000. I figure easy sale at nine, but we're throwing it in the auction uh, and whoever buys it can thank me now. This has been serviced. Uh, or thank me later, it's been serviced, it's ready to go, it is in absolute immaculate condition. Uh, it's from the same place, uh, West Elm, no business selling coffee, so this has got a very, uh, very low, um, very low amount of usage uh, thus far. All the refrigeration and this uh, undercounter dishwasher from the same place, uh, the West Elm coffee shop is now gone. Uh, it's in gorgeous shape, it's a low temp. Uh, we've got the portion control hot water dispenser, coffee grinder, they were using a Fetco uh, brewer with uh, more hot water and a couple of those. And then they have the Super Jolly electronic, which are worth about 1500 bucks new. And the refrigeration, I mean they spared no expense, absolutely no expense. But this is, uh, this is the royalty. Uh, people in the know uh, know what that's worth. So over here, just take a quick shot. This is all gonna be filled with equipment. Like I said, we still have a week from when you're seeing this and we have a lot of work to do. We've still got a lot of boxes to open. We still got another warehouse. We're also setting up the stainless still uh, for the three day online only. All, all this stuff is staying in our retail. Uh, it's owned by the leasing company, a lot of it. A lot of it is our new uh, brand, USC, US Refrigeration. Uh, the leasing company only lets us get rid of so much at once. Uh, they need it off the books, but there's some really big ticket items here that we're looking to release. And if you talk to Derek, there's often a, a discount to be had for re-renting it. In cash sale, we pretty much have to sell it. They really want to, uh, to re-rent it, like this Ovention oven, this is 10000 this thing is 6000 So, you know, uh, they might make it into the auction, but not yet. So, September 17th is the big day. It's a Saturday, it's 10, it's live and online, you can bid in both, but the 14th, the 15th, and the 16th, it's all online only, but it's all small wares, except for the 16th has some pretty high value stuff in it, like uh, refrigeration and stainless steel. So check that out, we'll do another video preview when the uh, floor is completely set. Thank you, bye.